Hello, this is Nagoji here. Welcome to the reaction video. And today we have two Godzilla vs. Shrew was Earth, also from a Suso production. I I know. Bad to bad Godzilla reactions from a Suso production. Don't worry, that's one won't be an Ace Suso. I'm thinking I'm thinking about it. I'm probably gonna be revisiting a lot of older Godzilla videos. Maybe I can yeah, take all your fans old videos on the way. Hmm. Who knows? Maybe. But today we had to um because of a stroke was rough. And I haven't watched this video since I was in high school. That's no joke. I haven't watched that video since I got out of high school. Yeah, I haven't watched this in a while. I literally have not seen this in such a long time. It's been like, what, five plus years since I graduated high school. I'm pretty sure I saw this back in like what 20 April of 2019, I believe. When I first saw it on my YouTube channel. I'm pretty sure that's when I first saw it. I didn't. And for the way I didn't do reaction back then, uh didn't have StreamYard. <laughs> that's my answer. Plus I didn't have a job at the time. I was basically doing school. So they didn't even have a phone. All I have is a computer. And both that said, um let's be at, shall we? Oh, I missed that intro. I wish it was too simple to come back. He hasn't made a video in a long time. Oh, God. Again. Twice in a row. This is quite some minute ago. Jesus Christ. This made my ears burst. So on uh, my computer. Like I said, I was using the back of Godzilla soundtrack. That is the best soundtrack in any Godzilla film, in my opinion. They make a US soundtrack. They also have a cool soundtrack. Any Godzilla film has a great soundtrack. That's Godzilla's Revenge. Oh, so yes, if before. Before people in the comment section start answering, yes, I have read Rules of Earth. I have read it. I've also read Kingdom of Monsters. Have yet to read Godzilla um, Ongoing. Yet to read that one. I have read Rules of Earth, though. I haven't read Godzilla Ongoing. I just skipped straight to Rules of Earth, didn't I? Just skipped Ongoing. But anyway, um, basically, this is thing. In the beginning, they said it was covering chap volume, f chap issue four, I believe. Issue might be issue, I think it was the issue four, I believe, that the Shore attacked uh, Godzilla. So that's what this is based off of. So just a heads up. Anyway, with that said, let's continue the video. And yes, I've read the Rules of Earth. It's a great comic. Probably one of the best because of the comments out there.
And there's a shrub. I'm not sure how the top that stopped the beam, but okay. Did nothing. I like that mostly though. And did absolutely nothing. And there's Muffa. Hey, this is called Godzilla vs. Destroyer, not Godzilla Martha vs. Destroyer. Talk about false advertisement. Also, like halfway through the video, Destroyer vs. Wing always really bugged me for some reason. I don't know why. Okay, this is one of the better. I am am enjoying this more than because of this gamma. I do think this is a better animation. Actually, I think this is probably the best one. To be Man, I grew up with this. Uh, so many fun moments. Oh yeah, the unusability that that guy used. The film. And there goes the other wing. I pay attention to detail. one of the better ones. I really did enjoy that one. To be honest, it still holds up from when I last watched it. <laughs> that the animation still holds up from when I last watched it back in like what high school when I last watched it. When I last watched this video Back in old high school. Man, I feel old. That was like five years ago. But wow. That, that was something. That was something indeed. That was... <sighs> so holds up. Yeah, I think I still think it holds up. I do think it's better than the last one that I watched, because of his gamma. Because with because of his gamma, not much really happened. They just eh, 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 eh. this one a lot stuff 
happens more, even though it's basically just a, a, a. <laughs> but it's more interesting of a fight because of how touch the detail of stop motion is. And probably took him a very, very long time to do this. Yeah, uh, uh, if I ever get into stop motion, I know it's going to be a very, very long part of this. I don't even have the editing software for that. Uh, uh, yeah, so. Mm. Would be interesting. Would be interesting to do. I wouldn't mind doing like an anim- If I was ever going to do like an- animation stuff on my channel, it would probably be like 2D animation on my channel. Maybe for the future. Maybe. I might convince somebody. I might convince somebody to do a 2D animation eventually. If that ever happens. Will it happen? Hmm. Interesting. I might. I might. I might. <sighs> but with that said, I enjoyed this animation. It holds up well. I still think it holds up after f- from the last time I watched it. Still pretty good. Ain't gonna lie. But there's one other video that we gotta watch before I move on to a different animator. And that's the granddaddy of them all. Is most popular video on his channel, and I can't end this research journey without watching that one. Yeah, I feel like I should probably end the Susa journey of watching old videos, at least for now, because there are a lot of them that I have to rewatch, at least for now. But there's one more video. I have to watch, and I'll do it tomorrow. And that, my friends, is Shin God's uh, legendary God's Law versus Shin God's Law. His most popular video on the channel, and I believe we talked about it in the Kenshin Chaos Breakdown, but we but touched about it briefly. But I think we all touched about it briefly, and yeah. Yeah, with that said, I enjoy it. It's pretty good. That's it for the video. And with that said, this is Sanagoji sign off. And remember, stay big, G fans.